Hey, welcome back to Larkus, everybody. So, we're gonna be finding the Moon Lord this episode. I'm pretty hyped for this. We're gonna be taking a step forward, a nice leap. We're taking a hop into the. We're taking a, a skip, a hop, and a leap into post Moon Lord, which has more than enough bosses for me to enjoy. So, uh, we just go kill the pillars, I guess. That's really all. There's not really much preparation to do. We have everything. Oh wait, no. There is one thing. There's one thing I can use, actually. Where's the potion lady? What's her name? Margaret. That's what I'm gonna guess. It's Margaret. What'd I tell you? Lillian. I told you guys. I didn't even know she was right there. Alright, um, mana regen, mana regen. Magic power, mana regen. Here we go. Get like 22. There we go. Why did I do that? I meant to do this. I don't have a, an, an arena to fight in the Moonlight. I just noticed this. Hold on, then. Go back. Let's go to the dungeon. Let's make a at least just like a longer bridge. Because I need a little something, something here. So there is some good stuff we get from the Moon Lord. I believe some of the stuff we're using it for crafting chairs. Anyways, we're probably going to have to fight him a good bit of times. But it's all good. I don't even got to do anything during the fight. Just kind of juke around. Actually, no, I can do stuff during the fight. It's just like whether I choose... If I want to or not. Are we going to need healing for this fight? We'll see how the fight goes. I usually don't have too much trouble with the Moon Lord. In general. But you never know. Maybe the fight will go terrible. Maybe the fight will just be the, one of the worst fights ever. I have against the Moon Lord. I'll just get decimated. Let's place this here. Place this. Hello. Place this here. There's a little gap in between. Stop! That was an accident. That was an accidental dash. Right there. Boom. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Let me cut down another tree. Let me cut down these trees. I don't got no. I don't got no like top. And then plant new one. You know, you gotta breed new life into the area. I'm always looking out for nature. You can find me on nature.com/gov. All right, there you go. That should be more than enough room to run around from the Moon Lord. I hope. All right. Let's, uh, do I even have campfires? I don't know. Let's play some campfires. Why not? Why not have some campfires? Because I just noticed I don't have any chilling around here. Okay, so we got to go to this one. There we go. We're here. Hello. I am here to enjoy, enjoy your company. It's probably summoning all my people. Summoning all the boys. Let's get, uh, like, two of these guys and then the rest are enigmas. Every time I say Enigma, I think that quote from SpongeBob that Patrick says. All right, hold on. I need to I need to place this so I can get more spawns. There we go. Don't step on that. Boom. Enigmas. Lunatic. What are they called? What are these guys called? Nebula mirror image. Nebula wielders. Heck yeah. I'm ready. No. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen too. I right, get all the ballistas out there too. I wish there was a ballista count. They should add that to Summoner's Association. Count for the ballistas. Just kill everything, alright? I don't really want to, like... I don't want to be near these enemies. The Nebula Pillar does not play around. My boys, this is one of the tougher pillars. This one, I, I don't like this one and the solar one. A little, a little tough. A little tougher than the other two. The Stardust one, I feel like, is just more annoying than it is tough. And then, what's up on the Vortex? Same thing, it's just, like, annoying. You got it? Pretty much got it. Place that, you know? Get that lightning popping off. As soon as that thing opens up. Lightning. As soon as that thing opens up, look, we got the shadow orbs. We got the shadow orbs on it. Alright, collect everything. Here, before my mind starts hurting. Alright, impending doom approaches. Let's hit it up. Boom. Look, I changed that to a button. Specifically for the Moon Lord. One, two, three, four. I kind of spread them out. Oh, whatever. How much? I can get like six. And we got our Larkus thing. We got our net. And we're going to have more. I don't know how many more. I think one more slot. Two more slots. So I think we should just put a rift. 250. That, that thing hurts, man. These guys fall through platforms. 
So maybe I should like just for here. Oops. Just for here, do this. Okay. Do that and then do this. There we go. And then we're gonna probably be using the demonic incubator. Why do I I always put the prefix? We're gonna be using the incubator. The incubator is gonna help. Oh. I didn't think it's one. I thought I had a little bit more time. Alright, we got we got two more slots. We're gonna do that and then we're gonna summon in a Larkus too. He can't he ain't even touch me yet. He ain't even touch me yet. I gotta sneeze, boys. Oh, the eyeball is open. What side? What side? Oh, I didn't even know where I was. Good try, but it wasn't actually that good at all, if I'm being honest here. Sorry to say. Get that away from me. Get that away from me. That tentacle. What are you gonna do with that tentacle, my boy? It's uh oh that thing is open. That thing is open right there. Right there. Get that thing right there. Uh, I need something to target with. I ain't talking about the story either. Right there. Get the eye. Alright, we got that eye. No, I got no I didn't get grabbed. Alright, we're good. Get that eye right there. That eye needs to go. And then that eye. Right there. Handle that. Handle that. Get on that. Get on that. Switch to the incubator. Alright, we're looking good. We're looking good. Ooh, that hurt. That did some damage right there. But look, we got regen. We got regen on regen right now. Just summon these around. I mean, it's hard to just, like, avoid it. It's really hard to just avoid that. There you go. There you go. Look at that damage we're getting out. Look at that damage we're getting out. Alright, let's just avoid now. Let's just avoid. Ballistas are gone. Three, four, five, six. There's six ballistas down there now. Alright, it's open. It's open. I hope I'm in it. Alright, we got it. We got it. And then summon that right there. I'm gonna get the crag rock down there. I hope I got the crag rock. And then back to the crabs. Yeah, look, I actually landed the crag rock on the thing. Is that what it's called? Crag bound, not crag rock. Alright, we pretty much pretty much beat the moon lord at this point moon lord's gonna have to do a lot to kill me i hope my npcs actually do something here can we attack the core come on guys what are you doing it was just like pure silence come on get that core i need that core dead i mean there's still potential we can lose if my boys don't go in here get that do i have a heal yet no i don't all right let's watch our mana buff up if we can summon another enigma Hold up, hold up. Get this like straight line we're gonna do right here. Get that straight line. That's some good damage. Out of mana, out of mana. Right there. Get on that. Right there. The core, boys. Get on that core like we're doing ab workouts. Where's it at? Where's it at? Give me that core. Moon Lord's core. I don't like how like the Moon Lord's like filter makes like flames non up. Parent. Look at the look at the campfire. It's like where the flames at? Hey, we did it. We done did it. Moon Lord as a summoner. Not the hardest thing in the world. Not the easiest thing. Not as easy as the other classes. I am O. But there we go. And we an extra slot. Celestial Onion didn't give us our slot. So you know how it is. We gotta go in here. We do extra accessory slots. And then we do one. There you go. There's our extra accessory slot. That's how you do it. Since I have multiple mods in here that add in extra accessory slots from like defeating certain bosses, that's how I usually do it. If you guys are playing with my mod pack, there's how you do it right there. There's the information. Use one of those. Uh, we got the Moon Lord collectible and action figure. I don't know if I have all the in action figures. Kind of sucks that there's no in action figures for bosses yet, modded bosses. But I'm pretty sure it's coming out soon. Hopefully. Let's see what this is used for. I don't know if this is used for any summoner stuff. Oh, spoke too soon. Look at that. Zeus's lightning lunar portal. Okay, so we do need to find another one. Yeah, we do need to find another one. And then we can use the star wrath. What's my light right now? I mean, look what I have is a light. I have a lamb. I have a goat. I have a lamb. Whatever. I have it. It's cool looking, all right? And I want it to be my light source. Portal gun. I mean, we'll keep it in here. Uh, put that away. We're going to have to find another Moon Lord either way. I'm going to sell that. Does this have a reforge on it? It does have a reforge. I didn't even know those can get reforges. I don't know if I have an Evolution B spanner. Let's try it. No, we do not. All right. So we're going to take the Star Wrath. I think I have a... Uh, let's zoom in here. I think I have a loot token. Let me see. Loot. Ooh. 
loot token. The one... No, I don't have a boss one. Okay. So we need a boss loot token. Which we get from the goblin. Because we are going to switch this loot... Oh, there's two summoner weapons we can get. Let me get two of them. There's... Well, we know about the vanilla ones. You guys seen what these do. This one's really good, though. Uh, the lunar portal staff. Well, I'll just show it off when I make it. Might as well. So put this in here. Something with Illuminite. Just toss that in there. Lunar portal staff. I gotta make that, like, ultimate. Craft a Hello? Can I? Boom. I typed it, like, three times in one type. Lunar walk. That's pretty cool. Uh, 3% increase movement speed is always a good thing. Fierce Lunar Portal. So what it does is portal and then... Oh, dang. I can summon in a bunch. 5, 6. Oh, man. I want to try this out. I'm kind of hype. I'm getting a little hype right here. I want to try this out on some. Let me try it out on uh, uh, Destroyer. Why do I, I always do that? Like, it's going to bring me to the top. Bad habits. Oh, no. Go back. Can you get off? All right. You know what? I'll just... All right. Make it nighttime. Do this. Oh god, I didn't wait. Wait, 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 wait. Chill out, chill out. Enigmas, chill out. Chill out. I want to try this out. I want to try this out because look, they do that like beam. Oh my god. They decimated him. Oh my. Hop in Jack. Hey, it's Halloween. I forgot. Wait, actually, I don't know when Halloween Terraria starts. But yeah, that's what that does. And I really wanted to see, since we can summon in multiple centuries, I really wanted to see that vaporize a worm boss but yeah we are taking this and we are turning it into this neutron star staff uh i do have to find another another boss so zeus lightning let's start with that let's start with the key because we got to make a key here and then use that key to fight a granite uh granite mimic please tell me we're gonna get it there's no way we're not gonna get it man we did this on the multiplayer and the only thing we got was the key, man. The granite key. Think they found me. Let's go to the dungeon. Let's do it here. The only thing, not the granite key. The only thing we got was the Zeus's lightning. Shoot, I'll use this. Oh god, it's already alive. Oh my. Oh uh, yeah, look, we got the Zeus lightning. Sweet. Uh, yeah, I'm not fighting those guys to summon in Moon Lord. I'll just straight up summon in Moon Lord. Forget that. I don't want to do it that way. Hey, my boy. So uh, I'm gonna kill this Moon Lord. And I'll meet back with you guys in a second. Alright, I said I'd come back after I killed them. But look at these lasers in action. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. You've seen like a bunch of lasers that are on my, si my side. My side. My side just zapping this boy. Oh my god. R.I.P. R.I.P. Moon Lord. You need oh god, I just noticed my health bar. <laughs> I was talking a little too much smack. Oh! Talking a little too much smack right there. I almost died. But we gotta go back the other way. I gotta go back the other way. Are they still here? They're still here. Summon all of them again. I was talking a little too smack. I wasn't even watching my health bar. Just be careful though. We don't wanna we don't wanna kill ourselves. Alright. Oh wait, there's a lunatic cultist somewhere. What the heck? Why is he here? Don't don't ruin don't ruin this for me, man. You don't ruin this for me. <laughs> Am I summon are my summon? Where are all my summons at? Why don't, where are all my summons gone? I just noticed this. They're all they all vanish. It went down. I don't know why that happens a lot as a modded summoner. Like I I noticed that like in the old playthrough. Oh god. I noticed that in the old playthrough too, that like summons just tend to vanish. I don't know why. Alright, just keep on shooting out crabs. We got the lunatic cultist unlocked. You know, might as well do this anyways, because we're not gonna be fighting any other bosses this episode, I'm pretty sure. So I wanna keep the progression in a certain area. What is that? What was that thing? Dude. <laughs> Why you gotta be here, lunatic cultist? I'm in the middle of something important here. I'm, I'm killing your, like, your lord that you're protecting. Can my, like, beam stop shooting at non-moon lord entities? Please? This is very important that I disperse this lord. Lord of the moon. I don't have mana. I don't know what's going on. Alright, we got him. We got him. Now we got this guy just running around trying to kill me. Get out of here. I can't see anything. Get out of here. You're just a cultist. You ain't even a lord. Where's he at? Pick up all this healing. Oh my. Oh my. 
He's getting zapped. I don't want to kill him though. No, 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 no. Chill out. We're not killing him. We need him alive. I don't, I don't, I don't want anything to spawn from killing him. That's pretty much why I don't want to kill him. All right, we'll use another one of those. Uh, these we can start trashing. Sell those two. And we got enough. We also can make the rainbow rod staff. Let's zoom in here. Let's make that rainbow rod staff. Rainbow. I'm pretty sure it's just called rainbow. Am I wrong? Is it not called? Oh, because I typed in rain, not rain. Dude, come on. I typed out the whole entire thing. No, well, I didn't type out the whole entire thing, but I typed in a majority of it. 369 base damage with my current gear. If you guys don't know what this does, it shoots like a bunch of like glares, ra rainbow glares. Some of the radiant crystal that banishes your enemies. It shoots a lot of colors, pretty much, and it's really good. Let's uh put this hopping jack banner over here. And let's store our gold. So there you go, there's that. Uh now we should be able to make this weapon. Let's type in What's the name of the weapon? Neutron Star Staff. It's a sum or a donator item. Neutron. Oh, I really want to keep it, honestly. <laughs> kind of want to get rid of my ballistas for it, but the ballistas hit for 405 Gs. I didn't even notice. They hit really hard. Okay. Boom. Neutron Star Staff. Let's go ahead and reforge these. We might be replacing some of our, uh, some of our summons here, dude. These are really good. Unpleasant. Nah, that's not that good. No, it'd be nice to get ruthless on this, but we'll we'll do that for now. Superior, sure. All right, let's get rid of the uh, Cragbound and the Engineering Rod. They had a decent run. The Cragbound, not so decent of a run, but uh, I want to switch. We got we got upgrades, so might as well switch to them. Let's desummon. Desummon everything that we have. These guys too, and let's test out these staves alone. Well, let's see. What's this one do? Summon a stationary neutron star. So these are both sentries. Okay. I bet these will eviscerate. We're just going to do those two. I kind of want to just like even out the souls. Make it nighttime. Um, let's go to the dungeon. Let's go to the dungeon. All right. Summoning this. Summoning this. We should be able to summon in a bunch of stars. Oh, my. That's a light show right there. All right. I'm watching this right here. The neutron star stuff. Stat. How much defense do I get? <laughs> I get 40 defense from being on the Draco Meyer. Watch out! Here comes the dash. This is really this is this is pretty. This is beautiful. <laughs> I can sit here and watch this stuff. That was what a what a what a great show that was. I appreciate the show. All right, I'm end the episode off. I know, like I usually do that. I usually do that. I'm gonna end this episode off. You know, talking to the mic. But I just want to say something. Uh, I went this whole episode, from my knowledge, without saying a bad, quote-unquote, bad word. Even though I said that, you know, not a single tutorial of your videos get demonetized. People are like, oh, you said a bad word in the first 10 seconds. Not a single tutorial of your videos gotten demonetized. I can say whatever the heck I want. We're going we're going back to curse in the next episode. But just so, just so if you guys didn't know, I can do it. You probably didn't even notice until I mentioned it. Thank you, everybody, for watching. My name is Gears101. Donate to my uh, PayPal.